Hey everyone, it's Arlene. I'm here with a video because um, this package is just way too good to wait for my Sunday video. So I'm super excited about this. This is from my friend Rachel in the UK. Hey Rach. Um, and Rach is Rach0113. Um, she had messaged me and said, you know, I want to send you a rock, Arlene. I just really, um, you know, thank you for the inspiration. And she really wanted to send me something. And I said, you know what, why don't we do a swap? And um, she always has the coolest stamps. I'm sure you all have seen her videos. Um, she actually put out a video on how she stores her stamps. And actually, <laughs> that might have been upon my request because I was really interested in knowing how she um, organizes her stamps and knows where to find what and whatnot. So you guys have to check out her video because she has some awesome, awesome tips on how to store different types of stamps, whether they're wood blocks, uh, cling mount, clear, etc. She has some awesome, awesome ideas. So go check her out. So I just want to say thank you in advance, Rach, for um, doing a swap with me. This is just really, really excited. I was so excited to ship out your package and I was waiting anxiously for yours to arrive and, and here it is and I'm just so excited. So without further ado, let me just go ahead and show you guys and I, and I scratched off our addresses, but look at how she, can you guys see that? See how she stamped the package also? I love these stamps. It says, posty, posty, don't be slow, go like Batman, go man, go man, go. That is so cool. And then it says fragile, handle like eggs and then she has little snail mail stamp. So that's really cute. I think that's by Invoke Arts. I think I might have seen that there um, or one of those um, stamp places. So there was a little bit of a problem in the shipment. It looks like it got a little pierced here, but I think this package went through customs. So um, so it's, it's, it's come across the world. So I'm really, really excited. So I think I'm just going to go ahead and try to open it from here. And I should have opened this to save some time because you guys, there's no way I'm going to make it in the 15 minutes allotted on YouTube because I know that there's just going to be so many awesome things in here that um, I'm probably not going to be able to get it all in one video. <laughs> okay, let me, um, oh my god, I'm so excited, you guys. Let me just, I just don't want to make sure I don't ruin anything in here. Oh my gosh, I totally don't want to rip this other, this... <laughs> It's so pretty. It's like so cool, this little thing that she made. Um, and actually, it. Oh, look. Sorry, guys, you're probably bored right now. I'm probably going to fast this real quick. Okay, guys, here we go. And I'm going to try to do this. I am at my scrapbooking island again um, because my scrap desk is a true mess. I got so many different things going on right now. So, okay. So here we go. This is just so exciting, you guys. It's just way exciting. Okay. So let me just hold some of this down here. And I have like this, this Ikea lamp like right here. So I'm sorry for the glare, but my recessed lighting in my scrap room, it's not giving enough light. So, um, and it's really hard to get my natural light. It says, hi Arlene, I'm so excited to be swapping with you and I really hope you like the goodies I'm sending. I picked out my favorite products and tried to send as many things as I could that are only available in the UK or that I know are hard to find. Thank you for the inspiration you gave me to start posting my own videos and become involved in the YouTube world where I have so much fun. Love and best wishes, Rachel. Rach0113. Oh, so sweet. So let's start off with this. Oh, wow. Oh my gosh, you guys, I have a Rachel original. I love her work. Those of you who follow her, um, she just put out an altered box um, three-part video, and it's just so awesome. So you guys have to go check it out. I love her style. Um, she's totally into the Tim Holtz grunge, vintage grunge, and it's, it's totally um, the style that I love. So um, I love to follow her videos, too. She's very inspirational. But look at how gorgeous this is, you guys. And I'm, I apologize in advance for the lighting. I, I'm filming this at night. I tried to do this um, during the day. Her package was staring at me like all day next to my desk. But I was just so swamped with meetings. And uh, work is just really crazy. So um, her box was sitting there teasing me like all day. And I couldn't even open it. So it's nighttime. And um, I was just so anxious. I can't wait till morning. I had to open this. Oops. 
Oh, okay, I'll make sure I put that back. The little um, butterfly fell off. I'll make sure I put that back on there. But look how gorgeous that is. It says, trust your crazy ideas. <laughs> that is just wild. I love it. Thank you so much, Rach. This is going to find a very cool spot on my wall next to my scrap desk. I really appreciate that. That's gorgeous. And I'll make sure that the butterfly makes it back on there. Thank you so much. Okay. So, oh gosh, you guys. I just, I have no idea where to begin here. Okay. Let's start here. Um, handmade by Rachel. Oh, look at how gorgeous that is. Did she hand stamp that? You guys, she just has the most awesome stamps. I mean, look at that postcard stamp. I love it. These are gorgeous, Rachel. I saw your video on these. Thank you so much. These are so pretty. I love them. Gorgeous. Thank you so much. I'm just like staring at them because I just love them. They're so pretty. Thank you so much. And then let's see. Okay, we have this. We have art glitter. Oh, this is cool. Fantasy film. I know, I think she has a video out on how she used this. Stamp it, press it, cut it, sew it, wash it. That'll be super fun. Can't wait to work with that. Thank you so much. And let's see. Oh, this is super fun to work with um, for your art journal. So when you want to create some, I don't know if you guys can see it. It's kind of hard to see, but you can create some texture in your art journal by using some of this. Really cool. And, oh my gosh. It's so funny, I was um, messaging Rachel and I was like laughing because I had shipped her package and then I turned around and I had a whole bunch of um, the industrial charms sitting on my, um, sitting behind me right here in my scrap table. So it was kind of funny. So I have to send her another package and then there was another order that I had placed and I, I got something for her. So Rach, thanks for being patient with me. You have more stuff coming your way, so. Um, cute little box could alter that and then hold on let me read the little note some things for you to alter the bingo cards are genuine vintage another ebay find uh, the puzzle pieces will make a cute mini or use on their own for a wall hanging with some chain attached cool oh um the slide holder make a really will make a really fun project decorate and add ranger microscope size glass cool so, um, so here's a box that can be altered. Very fun. I did a tin mini on my YouTube video not too long ago too for my brother. I made an um, an engagement mini for my brother using a, I think it was an Altoids tin can. I can't remember, but it was a tin can and they're fun to, to work with. So thank you so much, Rach. Wow, look at how huge this puzzle is. That is cool. It's like a kid's puzzle. She had mentioned this. These are really cool to alter. So um, just basically you could cover it with paper, cover it with medium, but first, you know, like what I would probably do is sand it down a little bit and then um, do a layer of gesso and then alter it from there. Super cool, thank you. These are huge. Thank you, Rachel, that's cool. Um, oops, sorry. And very cool, look at these. These are almost like, these are like game boards, or these are like old vintage style bingo cards. Way cool. And then this. These are neat. And then, how does this work? Oh, cool. That is cool. And I think you can insert um, pictures back there. Super cool. And then there's this. I found this website that actually sells these vintage bottle caps. I was so excited about that. Oh, cool. I love the color too. And these are the flattened ones. Nice. Thank you. Thank you. And these domino pieces. These are okay, cool. so let's see what I can look at next. God, there's just like so many different things. Okay, let's start over here. Oh, this is really cute. I had seen um, Laurel do something similar for Paula using like a little canvas. That's cute. You guys see that? So cute, so tiny. Um, I don't know what size this is. It's probably four by four. Really cute. Thank you so much. I love working with canvases. So fun. 
Oh wow, this will be really fun to work with. Super cute. You see that? Be fun to alter that. And oh, these are cool. Look at these slide mounts. Very cool. Stamps beautifully. Oh, that'd be neat to work with. Thank you so much, Rach. Very cool. Um, oh, no way. Oh my god, she got me some stamps. Oh, these are by, um, what's the name of that stamp company? These are all made in England. I love this. Look at that, you guys. That is way cool. Oh my god. Thank you so much, Rach. I really appreciate it. Oh, wow. That's a gorgeous flourish. It kind of reminds me of the, um, the Tim Holtz flourish. And some butterflies, of course. These are so pretty, these stamps. I love them. Look how gorgeous that is. It's like ATC size, maybe a little bit bigger. Crafty individuals. Here's the um, the URL. Thank you so much, Rachel. I appreciate it. Those are so cool. I love those. And this is Crafty Individuals Background Papers Book One. Wow, look at that. Oh my gosh, those are gorgeous. Wow. You know, the UK just has some really, really cool companies, you guys, that make some really pretty papers and pretty stamps. How gorgeous that is. So pretty. Thank you so much, Rach. You have, like, really packed this with some really great finds. I really, really appreciate it.